Megan, welcome to Southampton. How are you feeling about your move to Saints? Yeah, I'm really excited. Obviously, it's a fresh new start for me and everything like that. And been here a couple of days now, so it's, it's been great to meet the girls and start training and just get going, really. And what was it that made you think that Saints was going to be the place for you? Uh, so I came down probably about a couple of weeks ago now and, and went for a walk um, with Marianne around the whole of the training ground and just seeing the facilities and the ambitions of the club and kind of where they've grown from and just having a few conversations. I knew that this was the best place for me to be. Um, and I've worked with Lauren as well previously, so she was a big part of me coming here as well. And you've got plenty of championship experience, having played with the likes of Tottenham, Millwall and most recently Charleston Athletic. With all that experience, what are you hoping to bring to the Southampton side as they make that step up? Yeah, I think the championship's a really tough league. Um, so having been having played in it for such a long time, probably since the start of it, <laughs> um, it I can bring that kind of competitiveness and, and show what the girls need to be like in this league because there's no tough games. Um, so just the, yeah, the level of experience that I've got and being in and around this league for a long, long time, um, I know what it takes to kind of be, be at the top of the league. You said that you've got to know some of the girls already and yeah. you're coming in ahead of our pre-season trip to Scotland. Are you looking forward to getting to know them more and, and sort of, yeah, in a different environment? Yeah, definitely. I think it's important to kind of step away from the training ground and get to know people away from the pitch and things like that. Um, in a different environment, it gives us a chance to get to know each other better and yeah, have that team bonding that's very important, like on and off the field. And looking forward to the end of August, we kick off the season at home against a familiar team to you in Charlton <laughs> Athletic. What do we have to expect from that first fixture? It'll be a tough game. I know there's lots of new faces there as well that will be eager to impress and things like that. Um, but I'm, I'm confident that we can more than compete. And having a think more generally about the league, obviously you say there's a lot of tough games, it's a tough league. Are there any teams that you're particularly looking forward to taking on again this season, but with Saints this yeah, time? Yeah, no, definitely. I think every game is going to be different. There's, there's a range of different teams in the league that are all going to pose different threats. Um, but yeah, facing, facing your old teams is always, always a good thing. And aside from your club football, you're also a Welsh international and uh, spent last camp alongside our very own Alice Griffiths. Were you getting all the inside information on Saints from her? <laughs> I think it was, it was pretty um, confidential then, but I did have a few conversations and just kind of finding out a little bit more about, about the club and things like that. And finally, coming into this Southampton side, what are your personal aims for the season? My personal aims is obviously just trying to play as many games as I can, um, but I, I kind of want a new role here. I want to be a leader on and off the field as well and bringing my experience to, to the team. And, and some of the girls are very young, so I think using my age and everything and my experience to kind of get the best out of the girls and the best as the team as a whole.